Hey, what's going on everybody? This is hole number four of the Big Top Tournament Expert Division opening round. For the second par three in our round, we're gonna be using a sniper level five and above and either a Kingmaker or a Kingslayer ball, depending on our wind. We're gonna go with a Kingslayer ball here to keep ourselves below eight miles per hour. We're gonna go three right spin with no top spin or back spin. We want the clear ring to be about 50% into the rough with the bullseye at the edge of that shadow. Do your best to straighten the wind arrow up as much as you can. And then we're gonna pull at one wind per ring. So with seven miles an hour of wind, we're gonna go seven rings. We're gonna use normal power and then we're gonna apply a little bit of right curl just to the inner wall of our power circle. We hit perfect. Ball lands just past that shadow, second bounce on the fairway, and then we roll up and catch the right edge of the hole to get our hole in one on hole number four. Um, so the speed was perfect. Obviously we caught the right edge, so not dead center like we would prefer. Um, I don't really want to mess with the spin at all because like I said, the speed is really good. But if you were gonna change the spin at all, Maybe just do like like one click of topspin just to give it a little bit more push forward and hit dead center. I don't think it'll affect the speed um, in a bad way where it won't drop. Um, another possibility is just to do slightly less than inner wall of curl. So make sure there's a little gap. So you got the right edge of the ball and then the inner wall of the power circle. And then you can see like a little green gap. Uh, in between there. So slightly less curl. Something like that. But obviously we still got the drop. So happy with that. For further instructions on how to play this hole, make sure you guys click the link below and subscribe to Expert Tournament Guides through Golf Clash Tommy. Good luck in your opening rounds.